woke up to a cellular telephone notification at 5.45 this morning And discovered that I had matched with someone on Tinder My experience to this point would have me believe this was a bar But you never know if this will finally be the one So I hopped on an app, barely awake Saw I had matched with a fairly attractive BBW Okay, this looks promising so far But then I started reading the profile Say, and I absolutely shit you not It's of 9, 10 p.m. on the 8th of February Name redacted, it's no longer in control of this account But the best friend is You will have to get through me in order to win a date with the lovely lady picture Keep in mind that I have been conscious for less than 5 minutes But my brain could not handle this The first question I had was to swipe right Name redacted or the best friend This was followed by wondering why that 36 year old woman couldn't control her own personal communications Was this a joke? Was this a guy? Was this best friend absolutely possessive of name redacted to the point she had to control every aspect of her life? But more importantly, this shit woke me to fuck up at 5.45 in the morning. I didn't have to be at work until now today. Who is on Tinder at 5.45 in the fucking morning? The more I thought about this, the more confused I became. The more confused I became, the high my anger rose. So I sent along this reply, maxing out the character limit, explaining that this bitch was crazy. I wanted to say so much more, but Tinder only allows you roughly two paragraphs. Word of text. I'd expect no reply, but amazingly, I received one almost immediately. She said simply that if I knew the whole story, my opinion would be different. Okay, try me. Please explain to me why middle aged woman cannot handle her own shit. The best friend has to intervene in her life. Can you please send me proof that you are, in fact, a real human being? Or even a woman for that matter? Nah, this shit isn't worth my time anymore. I made my point in the match with the psychotic mess. I done installed Tinder for my cellular telephone. And now, if you want to date Slim Shady, you're going to have to leave.